And my name's Kelsey. There you go. You got introductions. All right, guys. So yeah. we are making another video. Last weekend we made a brownie. A big old sheet brownie. Uh huh. And now upon my request from the kids, they wanted to make a giant cookie. A giant chocolate chip cookie. So this is again a sheet recipe. So it makes a normal cookie sheet full of cookies. So we got little Miss Eminem here. <laughs> Because we're making cookies, and yep. I did not know. Uh-huh, but we forgot to get m and so we're going to use chocolate chips. Yeah. <laughs> and we got Little Miss Muffet here. <laughs> so, I will include the recipe below. Hopefully you guys really enjoyed the brownie recipe last weekend. Liked it so much we made it again a second time halfway through the week. Because the kids ate so much of it, the adults didn't get any. Ah, uh, I didn't. I shared it with Chrissy. Well, because you're watching your blood sugar whatever thing. Uh-huh, but chocolate chip cookies is healthy for that. Yeah, daddy. that's the recipe. Mm -hmm. It's, it's, uh, I think it's, it's backwards, backwards. Kels. We'll have to type it in, okay? We'll type in the recipe. We'll give you... See? Hey, put it down. Put it down. We'll I walk know. you through on the, each ingredient as we go through. So if you see on the stove behind us... We forgot to soften butter. Uh huh. So that's grandma and grandpa's fault. They didn't soften it. No. Nope. So we have we put yeah. boiling water inside of our kettle, and then inside of our mugs, we let it go until the glass was hot enough to touch, uh -huh. and then dump the water out, flip it on top of the but but butter sticks, and uh -huh. if you wait about five you minutes need or so. To calm down. If you wait about if five minutes, be in a it'll video be. On my channel, calm down. Oh, why? Because you see, Grandpa, he doesn't have that much energy. People aren't used to be people full of nope. energy. That's right. Okay? You gotta be calm and collective. And not distractive. And Daddy has a necklace. It's really yeah. gold. Cool. So, alright, we're gonna go through and we're gonna walk you through the process. Mm -hmm. So, Kylie's gonna be measuring, Kelsey's gonna be. A hyper little fart cheering us on. <laughs> so, there's the kitchen aid. Uh huh. We're just going to go right through it. I'm not going to pause. Seemed to work fine last time. Uh huh. But we only paused yeah, uh, once. Daddy, it's stuck. Yeah. Ooh. That's it called a vacuum. As the water cool, as the air cools, it creates a vacuum and sucks up on the glass. And see, that one didn't have a, a seal because of all the good? scratches. It's that fine. Good or bad? All right, I need measuring cups. Measuring cups. All right, the first ingredient is going to be two and one quarters cup of all-purpose flour. Good, Daddy. Thank you. Do you guys want to help me measure? Yes. Yeah, you do? Do you know how to do the double cup measure? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Can I try one? So we need two cups. Okay. What do you mean double cup? Watch. I'll show you once. And okay. then I'll do it the second cup? Yep. So how many halves equals two? Um, huh? Two. How many? One half equal two. So one, one two. half equals two holes. That's it. So how many halves equals two holes? Two. Nope. I mean two. You mean two holes for? Good job. All right. So you see how I took a half and fluffed it in there. I so, do it. yeah, do it. Can I do the next one? I'm excited to All try right. the dough. Who's who's gonna do the next one? Me. You are. All right. I'll help you. Okay. Wait. What happened? I mean, what happened to put a knife in? Oh, that's good. How come we don't do the exact measurement? Because with flour, if you scoop it with the measuring cup you want, if you scoop it, it packs it. And it makes too big of a flavor. Too big of a flavor? Yeah, it makes it taste like flour because you packed it so much. Okay. Oh, when I made uh, a cookie, um, uh, yes, whose turn, Kylie? Yeah. Over at our 
mom's. Um, uh, I I just packed it in and I put it in there. Oh yeah. Well, a lot of people, like Grandma and Grandpa, they will use a flour sieve like or sift. 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 You're correct. All right, here. You do this one. We need. The last, the last time, Kelsey, stop messing with it, please. Thank Daddy, you. What? What does that mean? And what is that? A flour sift. It sits there and makes sure that you don't have any hard clumps in your flour. Daddy. Yep. That's good, Kylie. That much? Yeah. You see how stiff it gets? Uh, yeah, it's stuck in the cookie. Yeah, and that's what you don't want. So don't pack your flour if you uh, want to. If you don't want it to taste like flour. Yeah. And it is a noticeable difference. I promise. You'll notice it as you get older, because I did too. Grandpa told me not to do it, and I got lazy and I did it. And you know what? I could actually tell the difference. All right, so that's two cups. Now we need a one quarter cup. So one quarter. That's what it says, right? It since she gets a small measurement because she's yep. small. And... All right. It would be awesome if we actually did M&M's since I have this M&M shirt. All right, shake it. We'll shake it, shake it, shake it. All right, dump it in there. So what's the next ingredient? Daddy? I don't know. Why don't you tell us what's the next dry ingredient we need to do? I think it's gonna be sugar or baking soda. All right, how much sugar? A teaspoon. Sugar's baking better. Soda. One teaspoon of baking soda. Okay, where's the teaspoon? I'll go get the teaspoon. Excuse me, Daddy. <laughs> Should have enough. Stop. Yeah. Yeah, my dad is oh. ticklish. Neither is my no, it's not. There's one teaspoon. One teaspoon of baking soda. Wait, let me read that. All right. What's the, how much sugar? Teaspoon. One Three teaspoon fourths. of salt. Oh. Yeah. All right. Three-fourths cup of granulated sugar. So how much is three-fourths cup of sugar, Kylie? Three, what, what, do you, what do you mean how much? How much? You have a whole, a half, and a fourth. How can you add something together to make three-fourths? What makes three-fourths? Three of these? No. That's correct. Three of three-fourths? At one, three of one Can fourth is three fourths. Oh, okay. That is correct. Right. The other the thing is, is a fourth and a half. Let your sister do one. Here, the other thing is one fourth and one half. No. That's correct. All right, let your sister do one. Hey, I want I'm, I'm just dumping it for you. Oh. I mean, scooping. Scooping. All right, that's enough for the sugar. Now, how much brown sugar, Kylie? Three fourths again. Three fourths again. All right. See, I can memorize recipes. Okay. Like how I memorized how to make Rice Krispies. There you go. Grab that brown sugar right there. Brown sugar. Do you know how to I do brown to sugar? Do it. I want to it has to be. It has to be packed. Little Miss Hyper, do you know how to pack brown sugar? Mm -hmm. How? You scoop it then we pack it. You I'm are the one correct. Who her. Good girl. Well, I uh, showed her how. Yeah. She walks, watches me make cookies sometimes. Well, that is good. That was scary. All right, how much you got? There's one. We need two more. One thing I love about brown sugar, Wait. when it's packed and it gets um, uh, uh, dumped out, it's like, it's like Sad kinetic sand coming out of a, a bucket. Oh, yeah? I think it's satisfying. Oh yeah? Don't drop the eggs. No. We're gonna need a cup of sugar again, aren't we? No, I guess we don't. No, I guess we don't. 
Alright, how much well, is that? Wait, who, who's, uh, what's smarter, girls or boys? Boys are, of course, smarter. They're, uh, they may be handsome, but... Ah, uh, are you sure? Yeah. You say boys are handsome, but they're not smarter. Yeah. Ah, I see. I so are you saying too. are you saying your daddy is not smarter? Well, you're older than me. Oh, so boys your age are handsomer, but they're not smart. Huh? That's probably huh? true because boys your age are stuck in games and videos. That's true. Yeah. You know. So, okay. Like, are you stuck in homework? Uh huh. <laughs> No. Yeah, my I'm glad I don't have homework. I'm glad that school do got delayed by a month. <laughs> I am so glad. I am so glad. thankful. Oh, put it out. Put it out. Why didn't we get it out of its wrapper? It's fine because I didn't want it to melt. All right, how you doing, Kels? Good I think you're silly. Uh, yeah. Can you move? I'm taller than you. Three. And I'm taller than the camera. All right. Thank you, Kels. What's next? How much salt do we need? One teaspoon. One teaspoon? Let me do this one round, please. Yep. Where is the teaspoon? Just... Here you go. We want... Can I hold it? Okay, don't shake it. Daddy's helping me. I can't see anything, so I'll trust Kelsey. Kylie. A little more? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 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 Okay.
Honey butter? Honey cin and cinnamon butter. It's really good. Pick me up, pick me up. Wow. That's amazing. It's satisfying. Uh, the butter sticking to the thing. Yep. Can you scratch it up? What color should I and get? It smells good too. Butter's finally getting outside of the whisk. Scoop it together. Mm, I want to see. So, am I supposed to take this out and mix it some? No, just pull it off the sides, off the bottom. Mm. Daddy, can I get the chocolate chips? Like, here's the chocolate chips. Yeah, they're yummy. And now they're frozen. Yeah. Daddy, um... Why is there, what, where is it? Well, when we were, um, uh, when I used to make cookies at our mom's, uh -huh. um, there used to be a little black, black, brown, dark brown sugar, dark. Yeah? Like, why is it in brown sugar? Because brown sugar, the difference between brown sugar and white sugar, is molasses. Did you know that? No, I did not know that. So it's basically just dried molasses? So, yep. Daddy. What? Um, so, mainly that so white sugar and white flour mainly got, like, separated with the molasses. Uh-huh. And the... All right, we're going to pause you while we mix this. We'll be back in a minute. It's going to get Bye. loud. We'll be right back. All right, we are back. Now let's see how much chocolate chips are we putting in it. I think that's enough. You think that's enough? Yes. All right. Why don't you take a little bit out and show the fans what we got? I want to roll it into a ball. Roll it in a little cookie dough and show it to them. My sister's going to make a ball and show it to young fans. <laughs> this is what the cookie looks like. I really want to eat it. So, um, what are you doing, Daddy? I am greasing a... 9 by 13 cookie sheet. Hold on. So while we had you guys paused, we switched over to a different beater on the cookie dough. Put it down, wrong way. Like that. Switched over to this to get a little bit better of a mix on it. Here, Kels. You can have that. Kylie, I need the uh, cookie tray here. And that's where you want to knead it. We got to knead down into this. Oops. Yes, I saw that. Stop, Kels. Do your job. All right, Kylie. Where's your cookie dough? Uh, Ball. Look. Get in here. Wait. Before you start pushing, we need to make sure it's all evenly spread out. Okay. And into the corners and everything. Yeah. We want to go for roughly the same level all over. So are we allowed to have a little piece? 
Yeah. Part of being a cook is to try. Your is stuff. to try. That's and why now, the cook never comes to the table hungry, because the cook has been trying it all along. But it doesn't mean get carried away and take a whole big old huge chunk. I know. We're My just getting a little piece. I already have one. Okay. All right, what do you think, girls? The dough is yummy. Right. There's our cookie dough. Uh-huh. All right. Well, you missed a little bit. We're going to cook it at 375 in a convection oven. I have an idea. What? We get, like, a pencil or a toothpick, and we write stuff on the cookie. No. Aww. Maybe next time, all right? Alright, so we're going to do it at 375 for about 20 minutes and we're going to check it and then do another 5 minutes if it's not done. Yeah. So other than that, it's pretty much done and we're going to put it in there. So Wait, I'm not opening we'll be back in 20 minutes, y'all. Wait, can I open it? You want me to turn it off? Yep, go ahead and turn it off. All right. Good timer. Alright, open it up. Excuse me, Grandpa. Mm -hmm. Smells good. So what should we have with it? Well first, how do you test it? Uh, with a tooth. There you go. It's going to be a bit crumbly it looks like. Really? Yep, go ahead and test it. Because of me? No, no not because of you. Nope. No what? Yeah, uh, it's not sticking. It's so not what so does that mean? It's clean. If it's clean, what does it mean? It's cooked well enough. There Good you job. Go. But now we need to let it rest for a couple minutes and let it cool. Do we have any icing? How about we make icing? It's or too hot for icing. It has to cool. I mean, well, we can make the icing while it cools down. We don't need an extra sugar on top of sugar, okay? <laughs> so why don't you come up here and say goodbye? Why don't you close it out like I do all of my videos? Bye. How do I do it? How do I close them out? Uh, I don't remember. You don't remember? That means you don't watch very many Grandpa's videos. No, I don't. Honestly, That's where you true. tell them. Y'all remember, God loves you, and so do we. Say, tell them. Remember, God loves you, and so do we. Y'all have a good evening now. Thanks for watching. Bye. 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 Hit the stop sign.